Oh. I got too frisky there. I was like, well, I only got set. I only got two bombs left. I'm like, let's try to get some on the trolled on ghost so we don't have to risk good RNG. Breaking one of the rules of my stream. Welcome in, Justin Bailey, 313. What, what rule did I break? I didn't even know I had rules. What rule did I break? I'm, I'm confused right now. <laughs> no links allowed. You got me there, man. Well, you know, if SRC would let me do a sprite hack ROM with like a Marin sprite or something, I'd do that. What happened? Um, I was dumb. That's what happened, Wookie. <laughs> yes, oops, I needed a bomb to get to the next room. I had exactly enough bombs to finish that dungeon. But you need one bomb at the beginning of the next dungeon. So, normally you just kind of hope you get lucky and get one off of a red whiz robe. I decided to be dumb and get frisky to try to... I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. But I tried to kill the Dodongo to get... Or smoke the Dodongo to get some bombs and... Instead, I dropped my second bomb too late and just wasted both the bombs I had left. And then I couldn't get through to the next room. I mean, I could have went back and cleared... I could have went back two rooms and cleared a room and got bombs, but I mean, PB would have been way gone by then. And, which, you know, we lost a lot of time on that walk to five and not having bombs for five, so... I'm not sure. Excuse me, how far ahead we would have been anyway. So many Gleox of shame considering the Don goes myself. Yeah, I saw you had mentioned you got a bunch of them on runs earlier. I don't get them too often, which I don't know. Maybe that was why I was like, let's get some bombs because I'm due to get a Gleok of shame. I feel like I see it more on people running three first though. I don't know if it's maybe just the global that you're coming in on usually on three first because you are taking a different route where you're going and getting the ladder heart then, um, doing the Rue Quarter, back to the graveyard, and all that good stuff. Hey, Owl's Nest. Welcome in, man. How's your night going? Oof. Yeah, Wookie, it's basically a rip run. I mean, it's a huge time loss. You have to fight the Gleok. You have to go into, like, what? three more rooms than you normally would because you use a key after the Gleok, so you have to go into another room yeah, to get another key it's a huge, huge time loss which I mean, I guess if you're getting the Moldorm key on this route, you could just get the foyer key later to make up for it at 9, but on 3 first I guess you've got to go in that room um like to the right there after you come out from the Gleox to get a key instead. I don't know, I've never really played Warframe before. I've seen people play it, it looks pretty neat, but never played it myself. Alright, maybe, we, let's, how about a Hadouken here? Can we get the Hadouken? Uh, Hadouken! 
Yeah. <laughs> Gotta save those frames. I don't remember what my count is. We're gonna take a bop there. I know I've got plenty of bombs, but I always like to force bombs on these gurias anyway, just so I'm full. I like coming out of here with eight bombs going into three. I know I'm just being greedy, but... Well, I messed that up, huh? I don't think this is going to be nearly as hot of a pace as the last one. I'm just guessing. That does hurt, losing that 36 second pace out of four. Man, that hurt. Which we lost so much of it in the walk and stuff anyway. I'd say even if we had had a pretty good seven the rest of the way, we probably would have still only been... I say only, we probably would have only been about 15 seconds ahead or something. I can't remember if I had to get bombs in seven on my PB or not, though. I know I did do that Rue quarter, because I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. Which saves a few seconds, but... Yeah, see? That pace we had last run, and now we got this. Oh, man. I should have just... I should have just... Trusted six from my mom. That's what I should have done. I still don't really know why I did that. It was just like a split second decision. I'm like, I want to try that the dog goes. It was not my best decision. But, you know, it's not like I lost world record pace or something there, so. If we can do it once, we can do it again. We did get our lucky bombs on the way in. So at least we got bombs right now. Hold still, you bugger. We could still come out of here green. I'm pretty sure I had a pretty lousy 3 and 4 on my PB. Not 36 seconds green, but we could be green. At this point, I just want to sub 35 so I can stop doing this route. That's really what I want. I would be happy with anything sub-35 just so I can be done with two first route. Because I almost kind of feel like maybe I'm ready to move on and try three first, but it's like, really want to get that sub-35 because I know when I start doing three first, it's going to be slower to start with. It's going to take me a little bit probably to actually finish runs. And like I said earlier, that sub-35 was originally my goal for this game. I had no intention of playing this past that, but... Here we are. Uh, absolute bullseye there. Alright, see, we're green. I still don't know how I was 36 seconds ahead on that run. Like, 
Like, I genuinely don't know how I got that far ahead. I kind of want to go back and watch that later, because I was really... I kind of wasn't even paying attention until I hit that split, and I'm like, oh. I really didn't feel like it was super fast. We didn't get the key. I have no idea what count is either. It's not really not not a good thing. That was probably ten. Pretty sure one of those was a ten. Or 1045 picking this up. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Of course, the bubbles don't come near me when I want them to. Farms always remembers. Pepperidge Farms remembers when you hit that kid that one night when you were drunk driving, too. Maybe Pepperidge Farms' memory won't be so good if you keep buying those distinctive Milano cookies, though. Alright, come on. Good fighting. That's good enough. Grab the heart, though. See, we're right back in this. And we actually have bombs this time. So we should have a good walk to five. Good. mess up any scrolls this time. We don't have to stop and fight stuff for bombs. We can just zoom, zoom, zoom through here. Well, we can, we can get position for that scroll. That scroll is always a little tricky for me because I'm always afraid I'm going to overshoot it. That was a good ladder clip, though. This is a much better walk so far. Yeah, I was pretty happy with it, thanks. Damage boost. Booming on through. Uh oh. Went in on the wrong went in on the wrong tile there. We messed up our P hat patterns. <laughs> Sometimes they just line up just right. 
I'm not going to sit there and say that I planned it out that way or anything. I just, I got lucky and the Octorox decided to walk into my sword. Well, I don't know if that counted as a one or not. Let's just go, though. Yeah, see, we're actually faster walking into five than last run. We're faster walking into five, and we have more bombs. So we didn't lose a million seconds on that walk. Uh, the statue's closer, and you save frames on the entrance from not having to do, like, the little walking down the stairs animation, like when you go in the cave, where it does a little, like, ch -ch 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 -ch. It doesn't do that when you go down the Armos entrance. And it's a little bit closer. best recorder room. It'll do, but it's not good. I think it's a little faster recorder grab than the last run, too, though. That'll do, donkey. Awfully swell if one of these Gibdos wanted to drop some bombs. Nope. Well, thanks a lot, buddy. We're just gonna grab bombs in seven. I'm not going to chance trying to smoke two Dodongos. If I still had five bombs, I would just try to get the bombs from the Dodongos there, but I'm not real good at doing it on a single bomb. I haven't quite figured out the trick to it. I can do it with the two, fine. That's easy enough, unless you're an idiot and you drop them too far apart like I did in seven, but... Good boss fight, though. See, look at that. Look at that. I really don't know how that was a gold five, though. It had to just been the lock. That's the only explanation, it was the walk there, because I had a really clean walk and I had bombs. That was not a good recorder room. We will definitely lose time, I think, because I'm pretty sure I had bombs coming into 7 on my PB. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. No! No! I messed up. I messed up bad, guys. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Uh, we'll keep going, but man, that sucks. See, that's why I shouldn't go for the tricorder. I knew as soon as that blue lever was there, I was screwed. 
We'll keep going. We're going to lose the majority of that 30 seconds because of that. That hurt. Bomb? No. No sympathy bombs, huh? Yeah, I mean, we'll keep this going at this point. Unless I just rip the run somewhere. We'll finish it, but... That hot pace is gone, for sure. Not touching the dongos. We're just going. We're just getting out of here. I knew I would do something like that. Stay away from me, Bubbles. Why are you in love with me? be hilarious if I somehow still PB on this run after screwing that tricorder up. It's possible. I mean, I have enough time to save all over this run. It's 100% possible. It's gonna be like the lousiest looking PB if I do, though. <laughs> well... Al, I appreciate it, but I think that makes one of us. <laughs> I'm not hopeful it will happen here, but you never know. We could maybe still be a little green coming out of this. It won't be good. Good enough. Good enough. Are you in love with me, Bubbles? Oh my god. Well, I think our green is gone for sure now. That was not really a particularly great seven. Ah, bombs too. I left the bombs on the floor. We'll finish this run out though. Man, that makes me never want to try the tricorder again after that. We lost so much time on that. It's not a fad till the popular kids catch on. <laughs> Well, I wouldn't say I'm one of the popular kids by any stretch. This whole magical sword thing still confuses me, like... Is this guy living under a grave? Is he, like... Buried alive and we saved him? Is this a ghost? Like, what's the deal with that guy? I mean, what's the deal? Really? It's 
See, that's how we should have trusted Six earlier. Ooh, that was a hot belfry. Take that magical breakfast room, thank you. No bombs, really? Whatever, it's fun. Beam strats, boy. Well, so much for that. Good enough. Thank you for the bombs. Yeah, I have... No interest in being popular. That's a gold six. Man, two golds in this. See what we can make happen here. See if we can make it happen, Captain. Didn't really need to kill those, but. Alright. Yeah, you get all those bots on Twitch like, hey, you wanna be famous? It's like, no, not really, I'm good, man. Thanks, though. I mean, are you really famous if you just buy a bunch of followers that don't actually watch you? Like if the whole tree falls in the forest and nobody is around. If you get 3,000 followers but nobody's there to watch it, does it matter? The million dollar question, do we get a potion or not? Do we get the safety potion or do we risk it for the biscuit? <sighs> but we lose like, we lose time if we get that potion though. <sighs> we gotta risk it. We're not going to get a PB by playing it safe. I'm going to risk it. I finished one without a potion the other day. Old Bluey let me down, dickhead. I do love some biscuits, especially with gravy. 
Gravy and biscuits is like my southern comfort food jam, man. Last scroll of the game. What's well, not you, me whistle? Oh man, I'm jealous. Uh, we do need foyer key. I forgot we skipped mold arms. Forgot to bubble bop too. That kind of sucks. Oh well. Yolo. We're probably going to get hit in the next room anyway, realistically. Alright, come on. No hits. No hits here. Oh, baby. Alright. Well, let's just go ahead and take a hit. Now we're at one. Two. Three. Four, five. Six, seven, eight. There we go. Good enough. All right, come on, Patra, be good. Oh, no, you dick. Why you do this? Really, bud. Alright, well. What's this room look like? We got three bombs. I don't know how I feel about these patterns. That'll do. Oh my god, stop it, Bubbles. This has a very slim outside chance of PB. It's not great. It has an outside chance. Well, that did not help. Decent recovery, though. We are really good on health. As long as I don't screw this up. No, come on. PB is gone, probably. We're gonna finish this, no potion. Man, with this much health, I kinda wish I knew how to do fast Patra. This has been a really good nine, though. I'm pretty happy with this nine, no matter what happens. Come 
Come on, let's get a swag arrow. No swag arrow. Fail. You know what? This is actually going to be a baby PB. You know what? I'll take it. Not, not as good as I would have liked, but... PB's a PB. I guess I can't complain. Thanks for the GG's. Sis Crusher. Flak Jacket Off. Owl's Nest. Blue Octorok. <laughs> you know what? That's true, Al. You believed in me and I didn't. I would not have got that if I would have got Potion, though. We would have lost that nine and a half seconds grabbing the Potion for sure. Skipping Potion and having a good nine is what saved it. Alright. That was pretty good. I was real happy with that nine. I'm, I'm just going to have to start skipping Potion. There's no point in grabbing it now. I, I got a PB and didn't, so. <sighs> Man, just think if I hadn't messed up that tricorder, though. This would have been like 3430. I think that's what hurts the worst. Would have been, like, well, like 3440, but. I would have had my sub 35 and I would have been done with two first. Home right. Yeah, that's gonna be some weird splits to run against later. <laughs> you got that huge gold five.